Of course, everyone wants to see what's inside, so I've loosened the screw so we can pull this off. And I have a padding to help keep the battery in place when the cover's on so it doesn't rattle around. But as we look at this, there's the IF transformer. There's the one mega ohm resistor. We have an, a capacitor here that goes across the uh, positive to ground. We have, uh, in this case, it's a 18 PF capacitor as part of the oscillator circuit. Um, this is what I put in as a variable, zero to 50 PF a trimmer capacitor set it around about 30 pf i thought i might be using it to adjust frequency but it's no needed i just use the slug of the if transformer to do that and hidden below all of this which you might not be able to see too easily is the transistor and that's going to be a tough one to see uh let me go ahead and turn on an external light there it is now i actually went ahead and reversed the polarity so that I have a 2N2907 PNP. So I actually have a, a positive ground and a, and a negative uh, power supply. But it doesn't matter uh, because none of this goes to ground. So in other words, <clears throat> I mean, none of this goes to the, to the mains. It's independent of the radio it goes to. So again, uh, this is built on a brass board, dead bug style. So that everything is tacked down and soldered. Uh, again, the antenna input goes to the ground side of this whole setup. And then the output of the transformer is what is down there. That goes through, uh, in this case, a 47 PF capacitor to the output that goes to the radio. And you can't quite see that so well there, maybe. A little bit harder to see. There it is, right down in, right down in there. A little bit harder to see. There we go. You can see the capacitor there. So that's the output coupling capacitor right there. And again, this is the oscillator circuit capacitor. This goes across the power supply. This is the tickler that comes uh, from the base to collector to generate the oscillation. And again, in the uh, collector circuit that is part of the oscillator, that is your, you can adjust frequency with this, but once it's set, I haven't had to. And of course, the power supply goes through the switch here, that you can see there. And that's very simple, very simple circuit. Uh, one transistor, a few capacitors, old IF transformer. Oh, and the IF transformer, I went ahead and used the yellow um, from a 455KC system. Um, and be careful, you do want to use a coupling capacitor from the output. You don't want to connect it directly. Um, I made a mistake of doing a probe to an oscilloscope with another one, and it uh, looked like it had, had destroyed one of the windings inside the IF transformer. So make sure you couple it with that uh, capacitor. Very simple circuit, very stable. You heard it.